Pigwidgeon and Peeves and the Peculiar Prank by Sparrow Potter Once, within the enchanted walls of Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry, a peculiar alliance was formed between Pigwidgeon, the tiny, spirited owl belonging to Ron Weasley, and Peeves, the notorious and mischievous poltergeist. The castle buzzed with whispers of impending mischief as the unlikely duo conspired to concoct a prank that would be etched into the annals of Hogwarts history. In the shadows of the moonlit corridors, Peeves and Pigwidgeon huddled, their minds brewing with ideas more fervently than a cauldron of polyjuice potion. After much deliberation and a series of hoots and cackles, they decided on a prank involving enchanted feathers and a mysterious bubbling potion. With the stealth of a cat and the swiftness of a snitch, the duo gathered feathers from magical birds and ingredients for their concoction. The unused classroom became a secret lair where the potion bubbled and the enchanted feathers shimmered with mischievous magic. The day arrived, the sun casting golden hues on the ancient stones of Hogwarts. Peeves, with his incorrigible grin, floated through the castle, causing distractions with his usual antics. Meanwhile, Pigwidgeon, with his tiny talons, placed the enchanted feathers and potion in strategic locations, his wings fluttering with excitement. The potion activated, and the castle erupted into a symphony of laughter and chaos. The enchanted feathers danced and twirled, tickling unsuspecting students and professors, causing a cascade of uncontrollable laughter to echo through the corridors. The great hall resonated with mirthful roars, and even the portraits couldn't resist chuckling at the spectacle. The professors, led by the stern yet amused Professor McGonagall, launched an investigation to uncover the masterminds behind the legendary prank. The students, their eyes sparkling with curiosity and amusement, speculated and whispered, wondering who could have orchestrated such a delightful pandemonium. The enchanted quills scribbled and the owls hooted, carrying tales of the peculiar prank throughout the wizarding world. The enchanted feathers became coveted treasures, and the mysterious potion a subject of intrigue among the aspiring potion masters. The clues, like breadcrumbs, led the professors to the mischievous poltergeist and the tiny, clever owl. However, the professors, their lips curving into secret smiles, decided to keep the culprit's identities concealed, finding a sense of amusement in the creative mischief. Pigwidgeon, no longer just the tiny owl, became a legend among the students, his hoots resonating with a newfound respect. Peeves, the eternal prankster, reveled in the admiration and the whispers of his legendary antics. The castle, with its ancient walls and enchanted corridors, embraced the legacy of the peculiar prank. The students, their minds buzzing with wonder, attempted to decipher the secrets behind the enchanted feathers and the mysterious potion. The whispers of Pigwidgeon and Peeves' prank continued to dance through the air, adding another layer of mystery and enchantment to the magical abode. The bond between Pigwidgeon and Peeves strengthened, their minds already brewing with ideas for their next misadventure. The castle returned to its usual rhythm, the laughter subsiding and the feathers settling, but the echoes of the peculiar prank lingered, whispering tales of mischief and friendship. And so, the legendary tale of Pigwidgeon and Peeves and the peculiar prank became a cherished story within the enchanted walls of Hogwarts, a story of an unlikely friendship and a delightful chaos that brought laughter and wonder to the magical world. The tiny owl and the mischievous poltergeist, with their shared love for pranks, continued to explore the limitless possibilities of mischief their spirits forever intertwined in the dance of enchanted feathers and bubbling potions.